Here we are for another Alpha Strike We Play video. My name is Adam. And I'm Taryn. Hi guys. Well, you've left me with a bit of a quandary, sir. You have indeed. Do we, we have a light, we have a medium, and we've got a... a no, it's heavy. It's not a salt then. What, the awesome? Or is it? Awesomes are a salt. I thought they were. Um, eighty tons of salt. Salt was uh, eighty-five and above. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, bugger. Because I'm actually thinking Shadowhawk. Oh, okay. Okay. I really, really, really want to rip the missiles off a of catapult and make it into something cool. But <laughs> I'm thinking Shadowhawk. Um, because we technically, we've done a catapult and we've done a commando. Battlemaster is just a no-brainer. Battlemaster. I kind of want something else, like, nice and fast. But I also want something I can use funky ammo with. So what I'm going to do is... I think Shadowhawk. Yeah? Yeah, I think Shadowhawk. Let's crank. All right. My choice. Shadow Hawk. Boop. Did you want to keep the same sort of speed, I will ratings keep and everything? Movement and jump all the same. Yep. So let's and jump. Okay. Let's go through this. The stupid Shadow Hawk. <laughs> you said funky stuff. It'd be the funky jazz Shadow Hawk or something. <laughs> it could be the funky jazz Yo Homie. <laughs> Fifty-five ton internal. having trouble riding today. Five and a half tons. <laughs> I'm knackered, guys. Give me some slack here. Uh, gyro and cockpit. So cockpit is three tons always. We need um, armor. So you can have 185 is your max. He does not have max, I can tell you that right now. No. Uh, let's put the engine in. So 55 by 5 is, uh... Didn't you say it was 275 or something? Yeah, it was 270 something. Yeah, 275. 275. 275, so 15 and a half tons. Yeah. So engine... 275... 15.5 tonne. My tech drawing teacher hated me. <laughs> Horrible writing. Um, should have been a doctor. I should have been. <laughs> you just scribble whatever I want then. Um, Cephalus. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a 5.8. And he's in the half tonne bracket, so Correct. jump jet. So one and a half as it stands for three. Three. And 1.5 tons. I'll keep it the same for now. We might mess that around a little mm. bit, but we'll see where our weights go. Uh, so with 275, the gyro is divided by 100, yes? Yep. So it'll be three. Alrighty. I like having just a standard ack to tell you the, the honest truth. Mm. What does the ack difference? So the ack five is eight tons, the light ACK-5 is five tons, but you lose range. By how much? So this is 18. 18 versus 15, so you lose three hexes of range, and 12 versus 10 for the medium. But the light has no minimum range. Yeah, okay. So it's not a bad move. The light can still take the funky ammo and bits and pieces. Yeah, well that's what I'm... Yeah. I, I gotta have one that takes the fun ammo, so, you know, that's why I'm doing this filler. Uh, so we're dropping the SRM, we're dropping the LRM, we're dropping the medium laser, we're going right back down to the back. And I'm wondering, maybe do the light one. Okay. So we don't have a minimum range. And we save a little bit of tonnage. So weapons. The light, AC-5, 
Maybe it doesn't come in a light Act 10, actually. So it's five tons, <laughs> like Act 20. <gasps> and two spaces. And light Act light, Rack 20. Light Act Rack 20? Pulse. Light Rack Pulse. <laughs> Shotgun Blast. Fire. Gauss 20. Mine laying. Rotary Gauss. <laughs> <laughs> Anti planet. <laughs> <laughs> They like banned orbital strikes. Mounted really. on the urban mech because you know that's the only mech that deserves to have such an awesome exactly. weapon. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Go with me. All right. Um, I need at least two tons of ammo so I can muck around with my ammo loadouts. We'll do our ammo loadouts separately. That'll be our yeah our one okay. little secret thing. Yeah, yeah. Um, so it's still twenty shots. Twenty shots per, per ton. ton. So that that's for the the normal AC five. Nothing's yeah. changed, right? No, it's no. still, um, yeah, yeah, 20 tons. Um, let's, let's see what sort of tonnage I've got left first. So 15, 20, 21, 22, 22, 27, 30, 33 and a half. 33 and a half. A lot of maths today, guys, sorry. <laughs> 33.5 from 55. So we've got 21 and a half tons to muck around with. Good Lord. I might even consider up in my jump jets. I see. Mm, double heat sinks up the jump jets. Maybe do an XL engine and whack another rack five in there. Or a rack. Ooh. Hey. Ooh, an ack and a rack. We have we have no gauss gauss weapons. We have no gauss weapons yet, do we? So our light gauss with twelve. The 12. Okay, okay, okay. I'm seeing a picture here. <laughs> it's not a happy one. <laughs> it's it's a picture of people getting dead. Um, a standard everyday gauss rifle is only fifteen. True. It's only three tons extra. Why don't you go heavy? <laughs> Mount it on that guy. That'd be hilarious. 18 tons and four shot per ton. And up his jump chair so he can jump <laughs> and then stand still and fire. I got one gun. <laughs> it kills everything. I'm going to make a hole in it with a, with a heavy. I'm going to find a way to fit it in. Oh. Um, take his leg off. Finger, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, a light gauss, you say? I'm intrigued. It's good range. I need at least two tons, so that's... That takes me back to 19 tons. So... Yeah, putting a, a normal everyday gauss rifle in there will leave me four extra tons, so... That's still good too. That's actually pretty good. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. So let's do two tons of Act 5 ammo. I was going to go three, but we'll go two. Two spaces. We'll do case. So that'll be half a ton. Yeah, half a ton in one space. Um, so we had 21.5. So we're at 19, yeah. I am doing it right. Uh, so the Gauss rifle is 15. Let's do this. Come on, people. Eight shots per ton. Still pretty generous. It's still pretty generous. And I mean, for 15 points of damage, eight shots is not too shopping. Yeah, yeah. It's just finding the space to put the bloody thing, that's all. Uh, you're good. Um, so what is it, 15 tons and eight spaces? Uh, seven spaces, sorry. Uh, so 15 tons. So we're down to four. Gauss rifle is eight per shot. Let's put two tons in. Yeah. Actually, let's put three tons in. Yeah. So I've got four tons. So if I put three tons of Gauss ammo in, I can add the extra two jump jets to take me to max. That's nice. That's nice. And then we'll have to go with double heat sinks, I think. Um, 
assuming we've got yeah, space for it all. We should, we should have. have. Yep. Uh, so what did I just say? Three. Yeah. Uh, so three. Mm. Uh, real trouble riding today. Gauss ammo. Mm. Three tons, three spaces. That's 24 shots. Three tons. And then we're going to up our jump jets to five. Which will be two and a half tons. Shouldn't need... I mean, you can take double because it doesn't really matter, but you shouldn't need double heat sinks with that. Well, the Light Act does... Two heat, isn't it? The Light Act 5 is only one heat. There you go. And the Gauss Rifle is only one heat. So, yeah, I don't think I'll bother. We'll just do standard heat sink. So, it'll give me 10 standard. Yep. And I think probably something like six of them will be... So, seven will be in your engine. Internal, right. So, so three external, three external. No tonnage for that. So let's make sure we did this right. 15, 20, 21, 21, 22, 23, 26, 26, 29, 29, 30, 30, 45, 50, 52, 55, 55. Nice. That's a nice design, actually. It's got it's got a oh yeah, it's got a big gun. But it's got a couple of big guns on there. It's got the speed. He's got the mobility. Doesn't have heat issues. When you take engine hits, then your single heat sinks are going to start struggling. But that's okay. Make it a bit of a challenge. But I mean, at most, you're generating two amp, uh, two heat per turn from your weaponry. Yeah. And five heat per turn from your movement. <laughs> if so, you jump, yeah. If you right, jump yeah. at max, that's seven points of heat total. So even if you add an extra five to that, you're only going a little bit onto the scale. So that's not too bad. That's that's interesting. And the only thing that's probably going to let it down is the armor, which I haven't technically added into the thing. Oh, whoops! Let's Boom. Let's go look at that again, shall so we? So what was what was his armor rating? <clears throat> so what did you? Oh, max was 185. 185 with max, yeah. Uh, whoops. It was 11 and a half. <laughs> That's a lot. That's a lot. What's he currently got? Um, it doesn't tell you the maximum. You just, you just no. got to add it up. So, 18, 36, 64. 36 plus 64, and then 32, and then 12, 20, 152, 9.5 tons, so 152 is 9.5 tons. They need to find 9.5 nine nine tons. Let's make it an XL engine, shall we? Oh, sure. No, no, I'm not <laughs> sure at all. That but that's my only option <laughs> at the moment. Why don't you go? Why don't you go to a light gauss instead? Yep, yep. So and we could go have, light gauss. We'll just have maybe one ton of ammo. That's sixteen shots. So that'll give you that'll give you five tons. Yep. I knew there was something I was forgetting. So light gauss is twelve. Yep. So we'll go to light. Twelve, and then is it still the same amount of sixteen shots per ton? Sixteen shots a ton. So we'll do two tons. Two. Okay. Um. No. Yeah, you're right. We'll do one and one space. So one ton. Sixteen. Okay. So still considering Excel. Uh, 15, 20, 21, 30, 31, 32, 33, 36, 39, 40, 52, 54, 59 and a half we're at. So I've got to drop four and a half tons somewhere. Okay. So you could go endo steel. That only gets me a couple of tons. It gives you like two. 
Yeah. Two and a half. Two. Two and a half. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Jump jets. Can drop the jump jets. How many tons do you have? Five. We could just drop a little bit in the armor. He's got good armor though. This this Shadowhawk version actually has pretty decent coverage for a um for a fifty five ton. It's got a, not as good as a Wolverine, obviously, but it's not bad. So remember, the armor protects the exploding ammo. Yes, but so does the case. <laughs> well, yeah, true. Um. Now, if I take an XL engine, that will make it extremely volatile. Yeah. And if you get an ammo explosion, you're out of the game. You'll be out of the game, but I'll be able to keep stuff. I might even be able to up my armor. Because the Wolverine is the same tonnage. What's my max armor? 185, and I'm at yeah. 152, so I can put at least another two tons of armor on there. That's true. We'll try it. We'll see how um, it works. Just try it, man. See what happens. So the XL engine. Will weigh 7.75, so eight tons. Eight tons. So that'll be 8.0. What's that? Five and a half. No, four and a half. Five and a half. Hey. No, that's 7.75. So 15 and a half, you halve it for an XL engine. So yeah. 7.75 is half of 15.5. So it'll be rounded up to eight, yeah. I'm pretty sure. So eight tons. It gives you seven and a half tons extra. Yeah. Hmm. Another light pack on there. <laughs> <laughs> Make it even more volatile. Yeah. Why not? Do yeah. it. Uh, eight, nine, ten, and a half. Eight, nine, ten, and a half. So I've got like three tons. Ooh. I can probably put that back up to a normal gauss rifle. But it'll only give you eight shots. <laughs> but it only right? gives me eight shots. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. <laughs> or like you say, I could put another light hack. So how much is a light hack? Five tons. So Five. Yeah, not quite. Three. Just drop all your jump jets or something. Nah. Oh! Nah. We'll, we'll give it another ton of ammo for the Gauss, for the light Gauss, so that'll be two tons. And we'll put another... Wait, how much did I say I had? I've lost it. Just three and a half? Two and a half. Damn it. Damn it, Janet. 5.5... <laughs> 5.5... 5 plus... So I've got two tons left, so I'll chuck another two tons of ammo on there. Ammo? Uh, armor. Oh, you want armor? Um, so... Yeah, so 185 is your max, and you're on what, 152? 152. 152. So 152. 152 plus 32... Yeah, that'll do it. ...is 184, yep. so I'll be one point off maximum armor. Yep. So I'll add, add my um, two tons into this, so this will be 11 and a half. And it'll give me 184. 184. Okay. <sighs> and that's why modding is so fun. Because <laughs> you go through and you think you've got this awesome thing and you realize you've forgotten something and you have to go back and tweak it to try and find the, the, that couple of extra tons extra. 
so oh. so weight intensive these ballistic weapons are, aren't they? It's yes. Just so different compared to the energy weapons that we were making. That's it. It's it's a lot harder to try and remember to put in the like you you want to put case in. You want to put um you have to have ammo for your weapon. You can't yeah. skip that, and you're almost always looking at a, a full ton at least for ammo. So it makes it a lot more interesting, a lot more difficult. So do it slow, not like me. Do it properly. <laughs> or get a, get a program that does it for you. Um, right. Which is what I think we'll probably have to do with these guys. Right, so there we go. We have an awesome... An awesome, awesome Wolverine. Wolverine the, the Logan. The Logan. A Shadow Hawk. Which is just going to be Shadow Hawk. Shadow Hawk. Because why not? The and a Shadow. dumb locust. And a yes. dumb locust. Wow. Okay. We, we have at least one that is all machine guns. And we managed to squeeze a Gauss rifle in there. That's good. And you've got an awesome with four Rack 2s. <laughs> well, technically you have one. I have a guy, yeah. I have <laughs> and mine may or may not be painted by the time we get around to this, but we'll see how we do. So we have most of the food groups. Most of the food groups. We just don't have any LB, LB weapons. Yeah, I forgot my LBXs. I was I was so caught up in the funky ammo that I didn't take an X. That's good though. No, it does. Like this, yeah, this guy gives you know, a chance to play around with some break out of your comfort zone, people. Stuff. And I've I've never actually mucked around with an MG array. That's why I was kind of happy with that. Like, yeah. like that, yeah. that sounds like it's going to be fun. I don't know how the heavy's going to handle it, but we'll see. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, this this is yeah, yeah. interesting. So we're going to go go away. We'll do record sheets up for these. Yeah. Um, and yeah, this, this is our lance. We're going to have a lance like this each. We're going to set our board up. We're going to have an objective and do a little scenario for you guys. And that will be the direct fire ballistic weapons battle. That's it. Boom. That wasn't helpful. That's it. Yeah. It's all right. All so, good. So in our next video, we'll show you the scenario that we've come up with. We'll give you an idea of uh, what we've got planned for ourselves. And then after that, we shall. We shall fight. fight! Round one. Alright, that's it. All good. Thank you, Darren. No, thank you, sir. Alright, thank you, people. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you later.